Let me think. Yes. So, are we done, boss? Yes, all done for today, Muye. Oh, and remember the TTK told us that they are coming to collect the car tomorrow morning, so make sure you room for when they come. Anyways, let me know when you've arrived, and please, don't crash again. Right, got it. Bye. <laughs> that was so fucking weird. Don't crash again. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like if I crash 20 times while recording. Oh. Yeah, he's got a point. Man, is this beautiful though. But I've always wondered what's on those islands? I see them every day. But I literally don't know anyone who's been there. Like, bro, we've been to the fucking moon, but not on those cool little rocks. I gotta tell boss about this. All right, let's see. Boss. Hey, boss. Just got home. Didn't crash the car, surprisingly. But I was wondering. You know those other islands you can see from basically anywhere on Italy? Yes, yes. Well, I had an idea. What if we organized an expedition to like, go see what the f*** is out there? You know, just for the views. Let me think. Fuck it, yes. Wait, for real? Yes. Go to the airport tomorrow morning. I've already got us a plane, a pilot, and an extraordinary vehicle for exploring in South Italia. Um, sorry, I meant after a. Wait, what? Don't question how, just be there. Um, okay. See you tomorrow. Well, that was easy. Ah, fuck! Hello, Muye. Hey, what the fuck? It's showtime. Cut, cut, cut. He may actually be dying right now. I'm good. The GPS chip I snuck in your lasagna yesterday tells me that you are currently in front of gate 3. Sorry, the what? Shut the fuck up. Our pilot should be arriving. Now. Uh... Oh yeah, I see him. Now you will also hear him. Good morning, Mr. Muyer. Idiot. Luckily, since I knew this was gonna happen, I got us another plane and I am piloting it right now. Wait, you never told me you knew how to fly planes. That's because I don't. Anyways, shut up, and get ready. Ah. I'm actually gonna die. Man, curious to see what car we'll be using. I just hope it's not a... Ah, oh, shit. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome on board flight 69D, with service from Italy to out of bounds Italy. We ask that you please fasten your seat belts, and secure all baggage underneath your seat, or in the overhead compartments. Um, you know I'm the only passenger on the plane, right? 
Remember that you've got channel members? Yeah. Face in your seat belt, and shut up. So, boss, what's the plan? Like, how am I getting on the islands? I am giving you a choice. Since we can't land here because there are no runways, you can either choose to land regardless, or you could quickly drop out of the plane mid-flight to assert your dominant Sigma grind set. The choice is yours. I choose option B. That's passive income. I never gave them names. Oh, fair enough. Then I'm going with the second one. Okay, bye. Wait, now? Yes. Fuck. Anyways, no big deal because, as you can see, I actually managed to fix it out of nothing, just as they did in that one Grand Tour special. It's a McLaren F1. And yeah, it just took me like a couple of seconds, really. Pretty easy. But anyways, all that aside, we're on the fucking island. We fucking made it, which is actually a pretty massive achievement. I mean, look at this landscape, and I'm pretty sure not many people have actually seen this or been here. But what am I saying? I'm the first one, of course. And legend says that on the peak of that absolute unit of a mountain, weird things can happen. So that's where we're gonna go. So as you can see, it does seem pretty intimidating, but we're good. Because look at this machine. too powerful. As we get closer to the mountain, I'm going to tell you a few things about this pigeon. So this absolute monster. <laughs> that was a nice jump. Holy shit. Anyways, this boy has some pretty incredible specs. So we are kind of struggling here though. Anyways, on with the specs. This pigeon has the 1.3 litre four cylinder engine, which is fully tuned, even though it doesn't seem so. And this gives it around 143 horsepower, which is pretty good for this little turd of a car. But remember, it has the funny blue bottle. LOL. <laughs> I actually never noticed that, holy sh Anyways, this pretty big bottle of LOL takes it up to an astonishing 250 horsepower which is insane. And on top of that, it has race suspension, chunky tires, double roll cage, as you can see. Pretty good. That's why it survived that fall. It is kind of funky looking, but come on, who gives a shit? <laughs> that wobble though. Anyways, ignoring the fact that beam navigator doesn't work, I want to show you how fast this boy actually is with the nitrous. Very stable, as you can see. Anyways, safe to say we made some good progress, but the question is, how do we get on top? Do we yeet it up in a straight line, full Arab mode, or do we zigzag? You already know, I'm gonna ask the Discord server. The server has spoken, but before that, I think I gotta pee. Alright, let's go! Time for some proper yeeting. Holy sh**. That is actually very steep. Hopefully... Yeah, no way we're doing this now. Bro, <laughs> It's f***ing vertical! Nah, no way. I want to try it again though. Come on. Nah, it just wants to skid. But we haven't rolled it over yet. Which is an achievement in itself. So let's try over here. This is not much of a yeet.
Eh ma cazzo, basta sbinnare però. This is actually may be more challenging than I initially anticipated. Right, I'm gonna try going this way now. Boy, are these textures high quality though. God damn. Anyways, this top section is kind of concerning me. Technically, this is a first gear yeet. All right, I think we may be coming to a stop here. I'm curious to see where the fuck are we. Oh shit. Right, seems to get a bit easier now. Yes. Second gear has been... Oh, fuck. Please don't get steeper. Wait, is this the peak? I mean, can't be this easy, can it? To be fair, this car is pretty great. But yeah, I'm pretty sure we're on fucking top. Yeah, guys, we, we've made it. Nice. But man, I do feel kind of dizzy, to be honest. I hope it's just the fact that there may be a lack of oxygen or something. But man. Wait, what the... What the fuck? So this entire video was pretty much made uh, to celebrate 100k. <laughs> yeah, I'm pretty late. Fuck. Anyways, we made it. You already know. But I haven't shown this to anybody yet. I mean, on the internet, that is. And yeah, other than giving you a nice little setup tour, holy shit, what the f I gotta say, it is pretty cool. It's... The cheapest me I don't even think this is metal. But yeah, I'm <laughs> who the fuck is complaining? And if I have this, it's because of you guys. So to everyone of you who pressed that nice little subscribe button, thank you. And I guess this was it. Thank you. Just remembered something. Where the fuck is the R-Series?